looking like that. Sora coming out for game one. He has faith in this character. He says it's he says he's top tier. Let's see whether he can prove it right now against Zomba, one of the best players in New York. Absolutely. And right now, we're gonna see Rob and of course against Sora. But the way do you see the way that the buzz is comboing right now? Like I don't know. I, I have a quick question. Uh, the bus is number one on the PR. Is Zomba number two? Uh, I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure. Th that's <laughs> actually the case. Number one and number two in the New York PR playing for seventh. Uh, sorry, I just wanted I just wanted to let that uh, let that be known. It's yeah, Zeno, baby. Uh, and oh, the buzz is looking like he is. You know. Even though he's playing Sora, he is the best player in New York, and he's proving that right now. He is intending to climb as, look at this damage! Rob being such a big boy makes him a big target. I don't know. This is, this is such, I, I don't, I don't think I've ever seen such good style of, like, Sora. And I really love the fact that, you know, like, the bus has been playing Min Min. You know, um, who, who else is even playing? Um, uh, other than Sora, he does play the uh, like you know, um, uh, Olimar. I know he's been also messing around with Rosa. He's played Rosa when he comes here as well. Uh, I think that those are the main ones, though. I could be wrong. Uh, nonetheless, you know, the, I think that this Sora is showing what it can do. This is looking like a Kingdom Hearts 2 battle, honestly. And like the thing I really want to point out is that like. You know, usually we see such a more methodical gameplay from the buzz, but right now we're not really getting that. We're getting a lot of just like more like oh, oh that reflected! Not that get what wow. I can't that believe that. That was must have been frames away from him getting spiked. I I mean it was really smart because it looked like it wouldn't have hit, but like still if he would have went like, you know, even in a different direction, that could have been so bad for that bus right there. Oh, well, things are not looking bad for him at all right now. Zomba trapped at the ledge and at 149%, and there are lots of ways for uh, him to set up for a kill. I think any of the neutral airs or forward airs can lead him to up air, which would definitely uh, end him at this point. Or an up air raw in its own right is enough to take it. We're looking at the buzz with a stock lead up on Zomba, looking really healthy right now. notice like the kind of position that like the buzz is kind of like taking right now like he has like like he's really utilizing a lot of these things especially like the way that like he's been utilizing a lot of his i think that's fair if i remember correctly right uh like yeah it, it kind of forces zamba to really stay like far away from him because he doesn't want to be in a situation where he actually gets hit by that okay even more damage knocked onto Zomba. Oh, and that's gonna be huge damage. And, oh, not a stock out, right? But live your Zomba, you're hanging on by a thread, teetering on the brink. Can he pull himself back though? If he manages to take the stock here, yeah, it could be possible. But against a player like the Buzz, is he even gonna get him the chance to go down to his last stock? I don't know. Okay, gonna go down to that last stock right there. But it's looking so bad for Zomba right now. Zomba is really struggling to actually take, you know, like some sort of control from the buzz right now. And then, oh, wow. <gasps> countered in his face. Don't, is that don't. the worst counter don't in the world? <gasps> oh my God. Zomba oh, oh, oh. almost reversed that in a matter of seconds. Oh, wow. I think this might be it also. Oh, went for that air dodge read, but he went the other way. Clever little Zomba. Not going to be dying just quite yet. And, I mean, we already saw what happens with a single uh, hit. All right, but there, it's so hard to avoid those Sora, Sora blades. And eventually, uh, going to be finding that up air. The buzz taking game one. Although not as dominant as we thought it was going to be. Because, who boy, that... Clencher in the blast zone. This is definitely starting to look a little bit more of a normal the buzz gameplay. He's been what, controlling a lot of center stage. For? You know. <laughs> but yeah, like, you know, the buzz has been really like controlling a lot of center stage, like we're kinda of seeing right here. And it's just been so hard for Zomba to kinda of get like control of that. That's really good on the buzz's part. Alright, look at this right now. Big damage. 
the buzz actually kind of playing from behind at this moment. And wow, that was really smart. Knowing that the platform was actually going to cover the thunder, that's uh, let him get an opening here. And that opening was Bill. Oh my god. Zaba is trying to end this dock off for right now, but the buzz is not having any of it. I mean, I can see why he wanted to end it, because look at what's happening while Liquid the Buzz is alive. Managing to get all of this percent, evening this up right now. And we've already seen that the Buzz is very consistent about finding kills at higher percents. Ooh, right now, that is going to not do it, though. Wow. I'm going to be completely honest, like, a little bit of early ultimate. I feel like that was a lot of, like, go-to situation. That was such a good Thundog right there. But that was such an early, like, you know, kind of ultimate thing we would see. And the way it's kind of, like, went about, it's just been stopped being used as much. But either way, it's still looking super bad for Zombie because he still has to take off this talk right now. Still has to find some sort of way to get back to this ground. But you can't if you have a big up air that's as good as Sora's up air. And I don't know. <laughs> Look at that. I know. And now we're going to see the planking begin. The legend of the buzz planking with Sora. This is its inception. A little bit of a little bit of a stuttered first step right there. Zomba managing to take that stock without actually receiving any damage himself. Things are up. This is an even game right now. This is absolutely going to be an even game. Zomba. Okay. Oh, no. You're dead, kid. No. Oh, wow. You're not dead, kid. Good job, kid. Oh <laughs> my God. That was. Wow. That could have been so scary for the buzz right there. I mean, listen, it's the, tis the season to be scared. And DeBuzz definitely should have some fear in him, despite how dominant that game one was. You know, it ended up being close to the end, and at this point, he's actually playing from behind. He... Oh, man, there are actually options here that Zomba could do to get the kill. Will he actually find them, though? He's trying to go for a ledge trap. Doesn't actually find the answer. Still managing to do damage. Let's see if he can actually close it out. No, back to ledge once more. DeBuzz looking okay. And this is this is something I feel like is a little bit of a concern. We saw a, a little bit ago where um, the Buzz used counter on you know the gyro, but does that actually it, make like a Bay of Witch time and actually make the projectile your own? It kind of looked uh, like it. I believe it does. Um, it doesn't reflect the projectile, but it changes its ownership. Oh. If I remember correctly, that's how it works. Maybe this is a better Bayonetta, I don't know. <laughs> oh, well, I mean... <laughs> right now, this character is, you know, we see him actually struggling to take a stock here. Oh, as I say that, this should be the end of it. Oh, no, I think that was a bit of a misinput on uh, the buzz. But to buzz his part, I'm actually unsure exactly when those links actually lead into a kill. So, uh, for right now, it seems consistent, but the buzz not actually finding them, and that means that Zomba at 153% is looking disturbingly healthy. Absolutely, this could be where we see. Not gonna be death yet. What, what, what was that? Oh, uh, that was up there, looks like. Yeah, I think he did double jump up there. Oh, wow. Anyways. Oh. Oh. All right. You know, <laughs> you were saying how maybe this is better Bayo. Let's see if he can pull out some Bayo stuff because he's going to need some crazy combo comeback. At the moment, the Zompa is actually looking like he is confidently in the lead right now. It's the planking. I'm telling you. Better Bayo. Smash for who? Nope. It was great from the buzz to actually roll outwards there, knowing that uh, Down Smash is so good at covering all the other options. Things are looking scary for both of these players. So I thought he's so, he's just at the very tip, almost about to take this game, but he has to respect the buzz just enough. At ledge, Ooh. oh, then he gets punished. This could be big damage. Neutral is not enough to do it. It almost does. I don't know how many more of those the Buzz is going to be able to take. And oh, 119%. This is super last hit. The Buzz, so if he can find another up there, that might do it. And you want to know the, the way that that's actually come to be like this, you know, such an even game. The Buzz is using, again, that, oh, wow, that, you know, planking again. Just making it so hard for, you know, Zomp to actually get a hold of that ledge. 
He actually it. finds it! An amazing job getting that comeback. The up air intercepting. I think he was trying to throw out a neutral air. And it's just a little bit too slow. That's going to be the buzz. Moving on 2-0. Zomba, number two in New York. Out at fifth. Sorry, out at seventh. Sheesh. Even I didn't want to believe it. Yeah, we saw the beginnings of neutral air there. And, you know, Rob neutral air, very safe once the move comes out. Uh, but it is not safe before the move comes out. <laughs> Did he pop off? Who's a little, little pop off? <sighs> oh wow, that was that was that was a pop up. But I, oh wow, I definitely I, I feel like a little bit more of the issue there was whenever like Zamba actually wanted to get anything, whenever he was in close range, he didn't really know how to deal with what the buzz was doing. A lot of those affairs, those nares, it was very hard for him to kind of just understand, you know, what was the right position in that moment. Because if you're not in the right position, you can't actually punish a lot of what, you know, you know, the bus has. And that's literally, like, how you actually kind of, you know, take this character on. But it's like, what is the right position when he's planking on the ledge? What is the proper zone to be in where you can maybe actually punish him for doing it without falling victim to it yourself? You know, it felt like when Zomba was like constantly trying to adjust and readjust where he needed to be. But, like, there are different ranges. Like, you know, the... Side B, the, the Sonic Blade is going to hit at a particular space. Then Double Jump Up Air has so much coverage. But I think that the uh, Blue Saga has even more coverage than mm -hmm. that. So it's like, at what spacing should you be to actually effectively threaten while also not being threatened yourself?